Welcome to Tomorrow Tech Reviews. In our previous video, we started a Terraform project with Terraform Cloud to store our state. Today, we will create a platform for our project using ECS Fargate, our scaling policies, and serverless version of RDS Aurora Postgres. Let's get started. We will use ECS to orchestrate our containers and ECS Fargate to run our containers. Advantage of Fargate is that it's serverless and ECS can scale it almost instantly. In front of ECS, we will use application load balancer to receive traffic from internet and distribute it to our containers in private subnet. Certificate manager will create TLS certificate for our domain. ECR will host our Docker images. Parameter store and secrets manager will securely provide us credentials to our database and other sensitive data. Okay, let's create VPC with three subnets, private, public, and isolated for databases. Next, let's create application load balancer. In this module, we will create certificate for our domain and all subdomains. Next, we create security group for load balancer to allow only HTTP and HTTPS ports. We create load balancer and two listeners, one for HTTP and for HTTPS with default action just for debugging purpose. Next, we create ECS cluster. It includes ECS cluster and uh, ECS capacity providers where our containers will run. It will use on-demand Fargate and cost-effective Fargate spot. Next, we create IAM role for ECS to start container and another one for container itself. Next, we will create latest RDS Aurora Postgres serverless version v2, which can scale reader and writer automatically in small increments. This Terraform module will create a secret in secret manager with username and password, which we will use in our application later. Now let's save RDS hostname and RDS database name in SSM parameter store. The last part is our module to create ECS service. Let's see what's inside. First, we will create ECR repository for Docker image. Then we create CloudWatch log group. In task definition, we specify CPU and memory resources for Fargate. We define uh, one or more containers in this array. We specify environment variables and port mapping. The most important part here is secrets, which allow us to define links to secret manager or SSM parameters. ECS will fetch them at startup and securely provide them as environment variables for container. Next, we define ECS service and uh, connect it to target groups in uh, application load balancer. When ECS scale, it will create more containers and register them in a target group. The application load balancer will distribute traffic across all containers in our target group. Okay, everything is ready for deployment. Deployment finished, let's review our infrastructure. RDS is up and running. We have a secret with our credentials for username and password. We have parameters in parameter store. Okay. 
our container also up and running and connected to database. Let's review environment variables in this container. As you can see, all sensitive data is hidden and here we also only see links to secret manager and SSM parameter store. We just created a scalable and straightforward platform for your projects. Check source code in the description. See you soon.